back, everyone. It's time for the grand finals of the Ulti Duo Duck Soup Gaming Tournament. We are going to be seeing, uh, well, in this case, it's going to be Asu Force 2 facing off against Grizz Carries. Already the match has begun, so let's get into it here as it is time uh, for the end of the Ulti Duo Tournament and the grand finalist to be decided. Immediately we see the kills coming out. Pretzel is going to absolutely dominate these two right early on here and he's going to take an early control of the point already 15 seconds in and continuing to gain it looks like soldier wants a little bit of revenge here he's going to bomb up on top of the point trying to do his best here pretzel's taking a little bit of damage but simply not enough right now he's going into the red actually pretzel's going to take another shotgun blast but pretzel is going to be able to take down his own uh, enemy right there just pulls out his own shotgun soldier's going to get taken down here comes around the corner goes right after him it's the circling of the point because when in doubt, try and juke around. Looks like he is using that Crusader's crossbow. Ubersaw comes out 77%, but it's simply not going to be enough. Soldier going to bomb up onto the point here. He's able to hit Luminous, and indeed, he's going to get taken down here. And that's going to leave Pretzel dangerously. So as both of them are actually dangerous. Look at how much health they have. Both of them are so far in the red. And a, an arrow! That is Luminous just going big right there, going to end uh, his enemy soldier's life there. If only Medic could have done the same thing there, that would have almost been epic if both soldiers were killed at the same time by the Medics. Either way, a nice jump there. It looks like Pretzel's actually going to end up on the lower side of it. It's going to bomb back up onto the point there. Soldier taking a lot of damage, and indeed the final rocket's going to take him down, and Medic's gonna caught, going to get caught in a bad situation. He's going to try and Ubersaw his way out of it, and no, it will not happen there. Medic will get taken down by Pretzel. Those, the, I really like the efficient to go for those Ubersaws. Um, he managed to get 50% off of them. It would have been nice to get the last 50 Oh yeah, the Ubersaw is incredibly useful, it's always been incredibly useful, and it's proving itself more and more the more people use it. The Vitasaw can be extremely useful, but you sacrifice that 10 health for the ability, I mean yeah, you sacrifice that 10 health for the ability to retain some of your Uber Charge, whereas if you're using the Ubersaw, you can just saw people's limbs off and you get Uber Charge for it. It's pretty awesome if you think about it, I mean come on, you're being extremely, you're being an extremely bloodthirsty, egotistical maniac who likes sawing people's limbs off with a saw, and you're getting rewarded for it. <laughs> Fuck how fucked up country is this? <laughs> <laughs> this is actually coming down to a very interesting fight. Um, it's coming down to Soldier Medic, Soldier Medic, both using the exact same loadout. Uh, medics are on crossbow, we saw medigun, and soldiers are on rocket launcher, shotgun, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, you know, the weapon makes a cap fight fast. Oh yes, they, both soldiers here understand the importance. Soldiers taking a lot of damage. They're both taking a lot of damage. They're so far in the red. Thankfully, medics are going to reconnect here, and both of them are going to heal up. This is actually incredibly close. This is the kind of this is the grand final we were kind of hoping for. But with the uh, Asu Force Two holding on to control of the point here, this is quickly turning against their favor here. Luminous gets taken down. It's going to be a little bit of soldier v soldier here, but Pretzel is able to heal up. He got that small health back, and that's going to give him the big advantage here. And yes, Soldier's going to take that shotgun blast to the face. He will get taken down. And they were able to actually capture the point for a few moments there, but it's simply not going to be enough. They're barely one minute in here, and now the clock's going to start ticking once again as we see uh, Asu Force 2 quite content just to sit on the point. Rockets are still flying here. We're going to see Soldier taking the upper ground here. Still trying to shotgun him down. Yes, the shotgun will be effective enough, and Pretzel will get taken down. Medic gets caught in a bad situation as well, and Luminous not going to be far behind. Now less than four minutes remaining on the clock. That's a little over one minute and 20 seconds behind. So let's see how this next engagement goes. Both soldiers trying to maintain the upper ground of the point itself. Both of them are going to pull out their shotguns, and it will end up a little bit worse there for Luminous, who's actually just going to commit suicide in order to get out of that situation. And there's nothing too surprising about that. Throughout this tournament, we've seen the medics committing suicide in order to get back to their soldiers just that much faster and get just that much more uber charge. Pretzel bombs in here. Soldier taking so much damage. The last rocket is going to be able to clear him out there. He actually had to reload one rocket in order to shoot him down. And that, that was actually an interesting little juke there by Medic. Even if it was unintentional, Medic ran up and Pretzel bombed past him. He actually ran back towards Luminous in that time. But either way, that's a 65% Uber charge and basically a 65% Uber advantage as well there for Luminous, who's also going to fake call every once in a while in order to try and throw off uh, Grizz uh, carries. 
Pretzel taking a whole lot of damage, but Soldier taking just about as much. And, I mean, this is seriously the duel of the Soldiers. They're both just firing rockets at each other, getting themselves in the red, pulling out their shotguns, and then trying to finish each other off the shotguns, and it's been working that exact same way pretty much the entire way through this. Soldier bombs out once again. It goes very wrong when an air shot from Pretzel is going to hit him halfway past, and that's going to work out very well. Uber's actually popped in. It wasn't even needed in this situation, so it worked out very well here for Osu Force 2. Once again, we see Soldier very... I mean, he's just, he is ready to get out there. He's chomping at the bit in order to bomb onto the point here. And he lost so much health through those first two jumps that it just didn't work out for him. And Pretzel's going to finish him off in very quick order. And unfortunately, Medic's not going to be far behind. Increasing the lead here for Osu Force 2, who are now about 2 minutes and 3 seconds in the lead. And that time seems only to be increasing further. We do see Soldier coming out here once again, probably going to go for the bomb. Uh, uh, content just to dodge around the rocket, actually. That's a new one that I haven't seen. Just waiting for the rocket and then dodging it. That's one you don't usually see. I suppose looking for any advantage he can, and it's still going to go bad, poorly for him. That upper ground is going to give Pretzel the advantage he needed. Ooh, Crusader's crossbow coming out here once again. And now Pretzel's going to be a little bit unhappy with him. Medic is going to get caught out, trying to juke around. He does! He's able to juke around, and Pretzel's now caught in a very bad situation. He's going to get taken down, and that means Luminous himself is going to get taken down shortly. 83% Uber charge, and that's an unfortunate situation to be caught in. And that does mean that Gris Carries is going to be able to recapture the point here and give them the time they need back on the clock here. 35 seconds for Osu Force 2, 3 minutes and 15 for Gris Carries. They need to maintain control of the points. Um, Soldier gets blasted way into the sky here, gets knocked back as well. The Medic coming out here with the Ubersaw, trying his best. Uber, so much Ubersaw! He gets the Ubersaw kill! And Medic is not far behind, actually going to get taken down by Pretzel and an additional Ubersaw from Luminous, giving them the 100% Uber charge they were looking for. That, that, wow, that is seriously just incredible that that just happened. 20 seconds remaining on the clock here for Grizz Carries. Or I'm sorry, for not for Chris Carries, but for Osu Force 2, who are maintaining this great position. Soldier's going to get, or Soldier's going to blow himself up, actually. And Medic is just going to commit suicide in order to get out of the situation. But it's simply not going to matter. That's going to be the end of the round here. A nice, excuse me, a nice air shot, actually, from Pretzel. Even able to deny the points at the last moment to Soldier there. I'd like to take a minute just to, uh, to share what's on the line for the grand final prizes. Um, for first place, we have a signed uh, vintage Chris Creed by Shade from HRG, signed straight rocket launcher from Lansky from HRG, um, as well as a high five taunt, um, a medic taunt, as well as uh, four keys. And then for second place, we have the exquisite rack, a vintage Tyrolean hat, and two keys for second place. Indeed, some really nice prizes there. Either way, Luminous is going to take a whole lot of damage. He's going to stay up and alive, though. And in fact, there's that Ubersaw. Or more quickly, there's the Ubersaw from Medic. is going to get take out Luminous, the exchange of the Medics. That's going to leave Soldier with more health. So the question is, is Soldier going to bomb in and go for the kill here? Or is he going to play passively? And it looks like he's going to play passively. And that may not have been the best thing to do, as that's going to give Pretzel the ability to get back up to full health. Pretzel, so many air shots, actually. It looks like Soldier comes out for the direct hit, actually. And that's what gives him the major advantage there. And that air shot was actually really nice in that case from Soldier. <laughs> The duel of the medics, both of them are so low in health. Soldier coming on back out here, but medic is way in the red. Any rocket will kill him, and one rocket is going to seal the deal there. And now Soldier's left in a very poor situation. Pretzel's still at full health, and they're both going to get taken down here. Restarting the clock here for Osu Force 2. They're about 45 seconds in the lead, and that time seems to only be increasing. And this leads back to the situation that is the doom of King of the Hill, realistically, is when one team gets behind and is unable to catch up, they're only going to get farther and farther behind unless they seriously get in the lead and stay in the lead. And that seems to be a trend that just doesn't seem to occur. So it's definitely not the best situation to get stuck in. And right now, Grizz Carries are going to be evaluating their position that they've just gotten themselves into big time. Pretzel whiffing two big air shots and they're forced to pop on the point. Uh, Soldier taking a lot of damage in the back up. Still dishing out the damage. He ends up going down and Medic follows shortly after with the bind. Ah yes, it's the pill drop. Literally the pill drop. Red team's gonna try and hold forward with a 10% advantage, try and catch them before they get their crit buffs out the door. 
and Soldier opting to go with the uh, the direct hit again, um, trying to trying to counteract Pretzel's huge DM. So far, two hits, three hits, four hits. There we go. That's what Soldier was looking for. All those direct hit rockets really worked out well for them. But again, that depends on your ability to actually hit direct hit rockets. If you don't do it correctly, it can end up very poorly for you. And it looks like it did indeed end up successfully in this case. And that is going to also accentuate another interesting thing about the direct hit. It has a hell of a lot of knockback. I believe it actually has more knockback than the original rocket launcher does. In this instance, it doesn't work out for them. Soldier gets taken down. Medic not far behind. Restarting the clock a little bit less than a two-minute distance here. It's quickly closing to a two-minute time gap, though, so... Medic has taken drop and drop. It's, it's not as bad as dropping Uber, but uh, he did drop nonetheless. And uh, Soldier taking it direct on the, on the point ends up being down to deep red health, 80 health, uh, while Pretzel's trying to maneuver around the point, trying to get a little bit of a buff to reapproach the, the, uh, the fight. Both soldiers get in their buff. One of them's gonna have to end up jumping onto the other at one point. Yeah, Pretzel trying to stay in the fight here. Soldier's taking a whole lot of damage. And this is, I mean, this is seriously just a case where Soldier is getting purely out DM'd by Pretzel right now. Either way, they bomb back onto the point here. Both soldiers looking for the kill here. Soldier taking a lot of damage, and the Uber does get popped, and Medic just gonna commit suicide. Bid farewell, cruel world. Farewell, cruel world. Nice, nice air shot by Pretzel. Finishing it off with a ground shot on Soldier. Medic's gonna try and come in with an Uber saw. He whiffs that and ends up going down to Pretzel's direct rocket. Yeah, so you have to close the distance, and that just leads to higher accuracy from the soldier. So it, closing the distance can either lead in you staying alive or you dying miserably. <laughs> soldier soldier opting to switch back to the rocket launcher. He's realizing that direct hit may not be the best uh, best plan of attack here. He's deep red, 40 health on soldier. He's going to end up surviving uh, through Pretzel's shotgun. Pretzel is entirely wasted of any ammo he has. Needs to take a chance to take a breather and reload. Oh, Medic gets taken down by a stray rocket from Pretzel. And that's going to be the Uber coming out here, too. So that leaves Soldier caught in a very poor posi uh, position. Excuse me. It looks like his shotgun actually just ran out of ammunition. The control point is being oh, there we go. Did not. Mm. Yeah, it's actually very, very common on multi duo. If one map, see, if one team seems to be dominating, quite often they'll forget to cap to grab ammo, um, and quite often you'll find yourself without any. I don't know if you noticed it, but Pretzel used his rocket launcher to actually knock the debris rocket launcher to him to pick it up his ammo. <laughs> Well, 45 seconds remaining on the clock compared to 4 minutes and 4 seconds, and this is Asu for us too, just kind of dominating right now. Pretzel's going to get taken down by Soldier's shotgun, though, and it looks like he's looking to turn this around. Luminous going to take that second shot. Will it be close enough? Soldier's trying to reconnect, and it simply will not be fast enough. Soldier needs to back out. He leaves his medic. He misses the air shot, but it looks like Pretzel's quite content just to go after Medic here. He blocks it, and an Uber saw from Medic, and it give them that full Uber charge, which, which is what they were looking for. Crusader's crossbow is flying through the air here, looking for a contact. Now... 3 minutes and 25 seconds compared to 35 seconds, and it looks like that Grizz Carry is going to try and hold on this point for as long as possible. The question is, how long will that be? Looks like we do have the pain train out on Pretzel here. He's going to try and cap that in as fast order as possible. Rockets are flying. They're going after it. Shotguns as well, already coming out here. Oh, he's running out of ammunition. He is almost purely out of ammunition, whereas Pretzel may still have some shotgun ammo in reserve. And indeed he does. And that's going to lead to both of them going down rather brutally. 30 seconds remaining on the clock now compared to 2 minutes and 59 seconds. <laughs> Apparently both teams are Grizz. <laughs> I'm not even sure what to think of Luminous's medigun name. Pump something 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 something. Pump Catface. <laughs> catface is for everyone. Pump cat face. Two, one, 
very nice air shot and a, and a pop just for show. It's for the stream or for the viewers, and that's going to lead 2-0 for Red Team. Indeed. So we are into the potential elimination round here. Oh, medic joining spectate for a moment. I wonder if they're trying to change some weapons here. They're, wait, they're sold? Yeah, they actually changed classes is what they did. <laughs> so, Austria Force 2 kind of confused here. They're like, what? You're not supposed to be going spectate. Thank you, you're kind of cutting out. What we have for the viewers is now we, we now have Medic on Soldier, and Soldier on Medic it might lead for some confusing comms in our casting. Um, see if you guys can follow along. Medic going down, but it's actually the Soldier dropping into a shotgun, and Soldier following shortly after. And Lumen's now with an 80% advantage. They're gonna try and want to pop in here as soon as possible and force a, force a pop or a drop from Lumen's. Yeah, Lumen's now in an interesting situation. He has that full uber charge, and he just needs to stay alive. Soldier, or I'm sorry, Medic, taking a lot of damage, and indeed, time for interesting comms. Medic is Soldier, and Soldier is Medic. They do push forward here, looking to get the kill. Uber gets popped, and they actually get a nice double kill with a single rocket there. And they're going to try and push back onto the point here, and they're going to successfully do so. So, four minutes and ten seconds remaining on the clock. Very nice air strafing by Medic uh, as he bombs in from a rocket jump. Um, now, I'm not sure if, if the classes as they be now means they have more experience on these. But we'll see how it turns out. Lumen's choosing the dangerous road again, going for those Uber saws. Sometimes I'd like to see him just attach to his pocket soldier and uh, and use him to body block. And indeed, that didn't actually go so well for them. Pretzel taking a lot of damage, and both players going to kill each other. It's always a fun thing to see an ulti duo. Now it's going to be the duel of the medics. Lumen comes in, taking a whole lot of damage from that uh, syringe gun. Three minutes and 20 seconds, Lumen's still taking a whole lot of damage. Pretzel jumps on in here, Medic taking a lot of damage, as in Soldier taking a lot of damage. And it looks like they're both going to get taken down, and at the end of things, giving Lumen's just that much more time to regen. Now we are almost to the three minute mark, that'll give them a two minute advantage, and that does mean that Chris Carries has not actually captured the point as of yet this round. Pretzel going in for the Market Garden kill on, on Soldier. Uh, first one we've seen in this, in this show on these two teams. The first one I think of the first one. Indeed, that is the first Uber saw, or the first Market Garden attempt that we've seen in the entire tournament, actually, I believe. <laughs> I would have liked to see some, uh, some, some gunboat and Market Garden uh, suicide attempts. Um, they can be so entertaining. Anyway, Pretzel and Soldier squaring off on top of the point here. Pretzel taking a lot of damage, or excuse me, Pretzel and Medic. But Medic will get taken down to the end of things, and now that means Soldier's going to try and stay alive for as long as possible. And that's probably not going to be too long indeed. Pretzel's just going to throw some rockets down, and that'll be the end of poor little old Soldier. <laughs> Two minutes and 30 seconds remaining on the clock here for Asu Force 2, who are quite content just to sit on the point all day long, and they're going to continue trying to push forward as quickly as possible. Pretzel actually taking so much damage, he gets shotgunned down by Medic, and that does mean that they're going to be going after poor little old Lumens. Lumens needs to get on point and prevent them from capping right now. He may have pulled it just long enough for Pretzel to get to point. He does. Pretzel stops the, the cap. Damage on medic. Medic's trying to trying to touch as much as he can. He's got 24 health. Finally, Soldier reattaches with the meta beam. A counter jump by medic, and they absolutely they manage to cap the point, putting a little bit of time on. But it's short lived as medic drops after an eight health, almost fall damage I think. Indeed, it was fall damage, and now that gives the point right back to Ostu Force 2, who are quite happy to take it off their hands. Another attempted Market Garden kill here from Pretzel will backfire. Oh, and he gets way separated from his medic. And he does end up getting shotgunned down by a medic here. 
Oh, Ubersaw comes out from Lumens. Lumens definitely trying to make a duel out of this. Lumens taking damage himself. Pulls out the syringe gun. This is Soldier just going after Lumens here. Lumens is going to pop Uber though and wait out the soldiers. And quickly, Medic is going to get taken out by Pretzel here, so that's going to be a quick end to that little engagement. Soldier not too far behind. Now 1 minute and 5 seconds compared to 4 minutes and 13 seconds. And at this point, I, I may think it's safely okay to say that Asu Force may be about to take this. Medic's still taking a lot of damage. He's actually able to take down Pretzel and Lumen, so they're still proving that they are still indeed in this round, at least for the time being, as they are, are, are a little less than three minutes behind at this point, but we've seen weirder catch-ups, so... or weirder turnarounds, I should say. Looks like we're going to see Pretzel jump up in the air trying to find Soldier here. He finds him, and he's actually just going to leave him all alone. Soldier doesn't need to be killed, apparently. Either way, we're quickly counting down the seconds here. 50 seconds remaining compared to 3 minutes and 38 seconds, and this is going to be a brutal long haul for Grizz carries if they're even able to recapture the point here. Pretzel doing his best to stay alive, not taking too much damage, actually. Oh, but Soldier, there's the Market Garden kill we've been looking for for so long. Soldier going to get Market Gardened by Pretzel. <laughs> And that is a fairly humiliating way to die, even in ulti duo, getting market gardened by the enemy. Uber gets popped, 20 seconds remaining. He thinks about going for another market garden kill and decides, eh, it's better off just to... Oh, he is going to go for it! He misses the market garden kill, unfortunately. He might be going for another one here. He thinks about it, no, he's just going to bomb on to Soldier. Soldier gets taken down, Pretzel gets shotgun down. Five seconds remaining on the clock, and this is Medic and Lumen squaring off here. Medic can't take too much damage, he's just going to try and get himself out of the way. Uh, medic is on the point just in time to put some blue time on them. Uh, they have three and a half minutes to go after they cap this. See if they can hold on and we'll push this into a fourth round. Very nice air shot by Medic on Pretzel against the wall. Um, and Lumens follows shortly after, holding on to the point just a little bit longer, extending, uh, extending the match. Indeed, Pretzel going to bomb onto it almost immediately. Medic trying to stay on it here, but he has to back up in order to see on top of the point itself, or else he's a sitting duck. Instead, he opts to bomb up on top, but he's taking so much damage, it's going to backfire quickly, and that's going to be Pretzel taking it there, because he's going to take out Medic. Soldier going to pop an emergency Uber here and try and stay alive for as long as possible. He's trying to juggle that Uber as best he can. Now we just wait for Medic to respawn. Medic comes on out here jumps immediately to the edge of the point, but he's taking so much damage. Medic goes down, and Pretzel's going to completely deny it, and that's going to be our GG here, because that means Asu Force 2 will indeed take the grand final, and Asu Force 2 has just taken the Duck Soup Gaming Ulti Duo Tournament. Congratulations, congratulations. The first ever Ulti Duo Tournament has been a success. Pretzel and Lumens coming out with a 3-0 victory over Medic and Soldier, uh, the Grizz Carries team. Um, good to see it come down to two Duck Soup Gaming uh, teams. Indeed. So, thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, we will resume with the Duck Soup Gaming League in the near future. And uh, without further ado, good night.